My name is Tony Silva and I want to talk today about enrichment. Parrots in the wild are always exploring. They'll go inside caves, they come down to the ground, they go inside tree cavities. They spend a lot of time occupied. They chew branches, they chew pods, they drop leaves, they look for insects. They spend a lot of time doing these things and that's part of their nature. They're playful, they interact with each other, they explore. They make games out of these things. In a cage, we eliminate all of that possibility. So we must find an alternative. The alternatives, the standard is a bunch of toys. We give them toys, we exchange them weekly, otherwise they become bored with them. But let's look beyond toys. Let's look at toys plus. And I really like to look at enrichment because enrichment emulates nature. Palm seeds and pods and pine cones even dried coconuts that are split open in the shell uh, will create a lot, of, a lot of amusement. It allows them to do things that they would normally do in the wild. We can take a tray full of pebbles and sprinkle small finch seeds to allow the birds to forage for those like they would in the wild. We can take palm seeds and wrap them up in newspaper. We can do the same thing with nuts. We can be a little creative to keep them busy. Because remember, a bird that is mentally sound will be a much better pet or a much better breeder. I've often heard from, from aviculturists that if we give birds enrichment or toys, the birds will not breed. Nonsense. When that pair is mentally sound, they will be much better breeders. As a pet, if we can keep them busy, we will make sure that they are healthier. They won't pluck, they won't bite, they won't chew because the bird is healthy. Let's target those areas and we will see the results.